if you have one of these old style timers uh, these are not the digital digital kinds but rather um, the ones that uh, mechanic um, it's easy to set it up uh, as you can see on this end there's the am and on this side there's the pm there is a little pin here this is the uh, on button so uh, see this the little pin so we're gonna say that we're setting up Christmas lights or just any lights there. So we're gonna put it to turn on at 5 p.m. And then, um, you know what, I'll plug it in this way. It's gonna be a bit easier to understand. So, um, so right now it's 9.30 p.m. Uh, so what's going to happen is I'm, I'm going to show you what's going on here. There's a little on off button. See if it goes to on the light goes on and then at off it turns off. So uh, set your little pin to on and then the little gray pin to the off. And for this I said turn off at uh, about 1230. So if I turn slowly and go to the actual time, current time, which is 9.30, oh, you see the light came on. There you go. So we're 9.30. So if I was to sit, let this work, uh, what's going to happen? This wheel will slowly turn clockwise, and then eventually you're going to hear the little click, and then the little button go to the off. See, and then you see that the, the light gets dimmer because I have a light behind me. It just turned off. And then, you know, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 a.m. And then this is the next day. Now we're in the p.m. And then when we reach the 5 p.m., oh, it turns on. So now I'll just leave it on the 9.30, which is the current time. And in a few hours, it will turn off by itself. So very easy to set it up. All you have to do is really take off these pins and then place them to the uh, times that you want it to turn it on and off. And the white one is to on and the gray one is for the off.